Mabuhai Finois, Kumusta Kayo. Welcome to new episode and challenge series of Trash a Day. My name is Mo, this is Full Finoi, and this is Trash Talk. So we live in a very environmentally aware area here in, in the Nordics, obviously, but the thing is not even here so well at times. And so we wanted to challenge you to a trash a day challenge. I'm obviously equipped with protection and I got my trash bag with me. And so this is a trash a day series starting trash talk. And uh, I'm planning to take a 45 minute hike around this local local neighborhood and see how much there is trash on the ground as I walk around this very common bike and food path. And as I walked here, I noticed that just around those bushes there actually was just my first objective, which I'm gonna pick right away with me. And the challenge starts here. Let's get to it. Let's see what it was. Oh, there it is. I wonder what this is. You obviously have to be careful with, with stuff like this when you're picking trash. But we at Full Finoi want to challenge you to take part, part in this and take care of your own local environment and mind your own own trash, but uh, we challenge you to go for a walk and uh, instead of always looking at your phone, why don't you have a look on the ground and see, see what's there left behind other people, maybe, hopefully not you. But so what we're gonna do today, we're gonna walk this side of the road for maybe 30 minutes, 45. 2, 3k and uh, we're gonna pick all the trash we're gonna find and then we're gonna do an inventory afterwards and let's see what we end up with all right so trash a day I'm obviously downplaying myself saying that I would pick trash a day uh, whereas I'm trying to look all the trash here on my way and even in this beautiful nature path we can find a cigarette but what a shame and it's full of chemicals and poisons. It goes into the bag. So we challenge you to pick trash a day, even, even on your normal day when you're walking out and about, or then go for a trash walk like I'm doing today. This place is obviously almost pristine, but still, when you pay attention to the ground, it's sad enough to see that there is trash here and there. Nature goers are sad to say sometimes also smokers and not all of the people are so caring about the environment and the animals so they throw the cigarette butts where it's more convenient for them obviously i hope i'm not going to find a lot of them here today but we have already raked one and this is obviously a good way to combine exercise and good deeds Another cigarette butt. I would be happy to say that this place was more clean than I that I expected. Chewing gum wrapper. Uh, a plastic plastic item from from winter, from skis. So that's obviously not littering. And uh, things 
things happen, but uh, I'm more worried on, on the cigarette butts. Some random stuff. Plastics or some packaging material. Wherever we live, we have to do this. So we challenge you, challenge you to collect plastics, gloss, like we found here. Oh goodness, I think we found the jackpot. Look at this. <sighs> yeah, this looks like somebody's stash for from decades ago. Broken bottles and all kinds of food wrappers and everything. But we're, we're just gonna, we're actually gonna leave this gloss there with the others, but <laughs> yeah. Even here in these forests you can find plastic wrappers like this. Some sorry forest animal, a bird or something will will eat it. Or it will decay as some microplastics and anyways end up in the food chain. Oh yeah, I gotta come again to this place. This is full of plastic shredding. So what we did now, we started this trash a day challenge for you to join us and to go out wherever you live. You can document it or not. You can choose however you want to do it. I would be happy to happy to have your your video on your trash walk. But have a little trash talk, go out and uh, have an hour's walk and, and see what you can find. So this is what our bag looks now after about 15 minutes of walking. Care for a cigarette? If you do, don't throw them into nature, all right? So we started this together now with Ao and uh, yeah, we're planning to do a whole trash talk series, challenge you guys with us and see where it goes. Hmm. Bike parts and cigarette butts. That was the eight cigarette butt, I believe. Ninth. Can you please hold the count for me? Uh, I know I, you, I haven't I haven't probably shown you all of them. Uh, for some reason this place starts to get busy now. So we got about a dozen of them now. Basically trying to pay attention only. Only about a meter plus radius left and left to the right. Personally, for me, this is very important and this is the easiest charity work that I can consider doing and the least time-consuming. Combining exercise and... This is 15th. Combining exercise and trash picking. And, uh, yeah, I read that uh, Close to 5 trillion tons of cigarette butts alone end up in nature globally each year. 
So squat at the same time. I'm squatting and picking, I'm walking. Yeah, so it's good exercise. Hmm. Yeah, you could even do lunges or backwards. Oops, I don't want to miss you. Yeah, you could really make this an exercise. Or have some ankle weights or or weights on your wrists. Two more. This has already started to decay, it's only the filter is intact still, but you know paper and all the colors have vanished. Finoy trash talk. Not the kind of trash talk you were you were maybe afraid of. Maybe like 700 meter, close to a kilometer now, just continuously. More cigarettes on the ground. Yeah, so this is really my pet trash, if I can say to have one, but cigarette, but that's the, that's the thing I want out of the nature. It literally never goes away on itself. And I kindly ask you to join our challenge, Trash A Day Challenge. Go for a trash walk or pick trash, one, just one trash a day on your normal routine wherever you're going or whatever you're doing. Just like if you would care enough to pick one trash and the more we are doing this, the more beautiful our living environment will be and the more impact we will be making. You no, know, if this is selfishness in, in its peak where you 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 get to smoke, you get to entertain and please yourself, and when you're done, you just throw the trash away. That trash that's you're consuming how much? 10, 20 a day of those? Are you throwing all of those to the ground? Like what's up with that? Come on. So pine cones and cigarette butts. That's a nice contrast. So this is what your squirrels eat. And this is what we leave leave for the animals on the ground. Well hello there. Who are you? Little critter. Where are you going? Why? No, you're just a critter. Go, go, go. Don't stand on the road. Hey, buddy. There's bikes coming. Yeah, you have wings also. How long we've we been here? In one way. Do 
you see anything disturbing? I'm not talking about the biker. <laughs> Bikers are nice, joggers are nice, walkers are nice, but as long as you don't smoke and throw the cigarettes to the ground. Trash talk. This is what it is. This is what it's about. This is what is this is what it is about. Trash talk. Just go all the way to the sign over there, and then we'll turn back. Yeah, look here. Oops, there's a there's a paper or the filter wrapper, just completely unwrapped, and somebody or something has taken. Or flush the filter away. Hope it's not a bird or a frog or something. Thinks it's a treat. Takes it away. Ooh. So a ballpark of 50 squats and 50 ish. Of cigarette butts one way. Let's see. Now I'm picking two with one squat. That's cheating. You should be squatting on each of them, yeah I know. I know, but there's so many so I think I'm having enough exercise with, with this way also. Two already. I found two already when I turned around. Ooh, I'm chased by chased by some animal. Look at this little critter. Whoa, leave me alone. Jeez. Trash bag must smell so bad that it's chasing me. Continues on this side, as I can see. Fourth. Some aluminium foil. Can you please check for me? How long does it take for aluminium to decompose? Let me know. How many years? How many zeros? I can stay there. Uh, is that McDonald's? 
just as I was, as I was talking about ditches. Burger King. Well, hello, Burger King. You got to be on the channel. Um, what am I, guys, by the way, supposed to answer to YouTube? YouTube's question on product placement. Am I featuring products and services on, on this video? <laughs> Burger King just at least made it to the video. Yeah, the back is starting to weigh about half a kilo. We're, we're definitely... We're definitely uh, 40, 50 plus with the cigarette butts. And I'm really happy of that. Yeah, I know some parts of the world, I mean... There's more trash than you can see green here. I know th that for a fact, but uh, as I don't have the opportunity to be cleaning the provinces right now, so I'm cleaning my own environment and I would be so happy to have you really with us and do all your best and all that you can where, where you are and record a short video, share it, share this video and uh, let's post about this and let's make a difference. I've been part of the... I'm a diver myself and I've been part of the Paddy Aware program and we've done coastal cleanups wearing diving gear and picking up litter from, from the ocean floor and uh, then I've been part of the Trash Hero program in Southeast Asia prior to this but uh, yeah I'm looking forward to uh, make a difference this way and maybe build this onward from here with you guys but uh, if if any trash hero or aware participant watches this so big shout out to you and let me know where you are and I'd be happy to collaborate I wanna thank you so much for joining already we're not quite done here yet, but uh, I just want to give out a word of appreciation at this point and uh, thank you guys for joining for the walk, liking and commenting, sharing this video. And uh, I'm so happy to have your comments and what we can do in the future. Little ladybird. Oops. Yeah, so these two don't fit together. Let's leave the ladybird alone and remove the cigarette butt. So, yeah, happy to have you guys here with me today and uh, share this video, like our channel, subscribe to us and uh, let's develop the story together. Yeah, so I actually removed my gloves already and the bag that we collected is here and I do not want to start doing the inventory that I promised or I was talking about, but you can trust me, it's full of the good stuff and uh, yeah we got it uh, away from the forest